USS Ashland and USS Germantown have replaced the aircraft carrier USS George Washington in the Philippines as Operation Damayan continues. U.S. Marines are a big part of that humanitarian effort. They're working with the Philippine government to speed up the process of delivering aid. Petty Officer Brett Cody has the latest. Marines from Marine Wing Support Squadron 172 Aviation Operations are breaking down their camp in Guillaume Province in the Philippines. Our mission here was just to uh, supply the 22s, or the Ospreys, with fuel whenever they needed it. We also helped take out supplies from many of the C-130s, whatever needed to get done around here, basically, we, we were here to help. The Marines helped the Philippine government set up a hub where aircraft could land, deliver supplies, and refuel. Us being here on the ground with the ground or with the aviation fuel on the ground has helped the birds out a lot because the, instead of having to go you know, five miles off coast and land on a moving carrier, they've just been they've been coming here, and uh, it's it's really sped up the process. We've we've been able to get a lot of uh, ospreys in at one time, fuel them, and get them back up in the air. The arrival of a battalion of Philippine Marines, air traffic controllers, and other agencies is what is allowing the U.S. Marines to close down their operations. Like we have the battalion of the Philippines came in yesterday, Philippine Marine Corps. We have the 8th ID Brigade that is here. We have the Civil Aviation Authority of the Philippines here ready to take air traffic control. And we have the Armed Forces of the Philippines providing their CMO assessment. That means our capabilities are no longer required to run this airfield. From the Philippines, I'm Petty Officer Brett Cody.